Well, hey, Capricorn. Thank you guys so much for coming back to my channel. If you guys are new, hello, I am Yasmin. If you have not already, please like and subscribe. Capricorn, this is your week ahead reading and love and finances. We're going to go right into it um, to see what we have for you. Let me just go ahead and say this. I want to say this throughout the whole video because I know people be fast forwarding it, okay? Um, your three month reading will be um, in the uh, comment section, okay, for your three month reading, three months out. That is going to be part one. Part two is going to be coming either tomorrow or the day after. So part one. I want to make sure I say this throughout the reading, you know, preferably in the middle so you guys, you won't miss. But let's go ahead. Let's get into your reading. I apologize about that because it's, it's, been, it's been a while. I forgot I was supposed to tell you guys that. So let's go ahead. Let's get into your reading, Capricorn. Your week ahead. Let's see what we got for you guys. This is for Capricorn. Capricorn. Let's get one more. Okay. So I wanted to get I want to get four, but I wanted to at least see what's happening here. Oof, we got the nine of swords, Capricorn. What's going on here? See you guys are feeling very stressed out. Oof. Capricorn. We got the Nine of Swords and the Three of Swords here. A lot of disappointment and heartbreak. What is happening? Listen, you guys have the Ace of Cups. See, Capricorn, I told you. This is what I've been telling you guys. Just it, hold on. Hold on a little bit longer, and I'm telling you what you want is going to come in here. A lot of you guys have lost hope, lost faith, and what you feel is going to be meant for you, and it's coming in here. I love the fact that the Ace of Cups is right came right after that Three of Swords. Let's go ahead. Let's do one more. There's your Knight. Love is coming in. Even with the Chariot. I love it. Now, some of you guys could be stressed out over money, finance, okay? Um, but even that, even if this was a finance reading... It's going to be something well worth it here with the Ace of Cups overflowing with goodness. Also here with the Knight of Cups with an offer of some sort. But I'm telling you, this is going to be everything. This is finally moving forward. What you guys have been waiting for for so long. You guys have been through so much. So we're going to go ahead and keep going. We're going to get some more and then we're going to clarify. Oh, I love this. This is for Capricorn. Capricorn. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, some of you guys are juggling finances. Your emotions are all over the place, but you're, you're giving that up. You, you're leaving that alone. Here with this five of wands, conflict, obstacles, things getting in the way of your love, things happening when it comes down to your finances that have not been right or correct. This is what you guys have been feeling. Instability all the way. And then look at what happens. Look at what happens. Communication, moving forward. How many times do we have to keep seeing that? Even with the chariot, it's coming, guys. Please hold on. I know a lot of you guys be in the comment section saying, when, when? I can't tell you when, especially it's a general reading. Um, but even then, time is so fluid, but you see it. So that means it's coming. Please hold on, guys, please. Okay. A lot of communication, a lot of moving forward. New love is coming in here. Love is coming in here. But this is probably present. A lot of you guys are in this energy of a lot of stress, disappointment, heartache, that type of thing. And then it's just, this is it. And then here's your future. So much goodness here. Stability, even with finances. finances. This is something tangible with love. Let's get your last card. Oh, I love this last part of your reading. Look at what was going to come out. World, right? Success, new beginnings. But then look at what came out. Eight of Pentacles. This is, work is going to be amazing. Okay, where you guys may have been juggling finances before, amazing. Even when this comes down to a love relationship, someone who's going to build with you, this is everything. 
But like I said, you guys are still in this energy of conflict with your heart and your mind. We're going to go ahead and clarify these cards here. Your reading is simply amazing. I love what's about to happen for you. So we're going to go ahead and clarify this. We're going to start with the Nine of Swords for Capricorn. Nine of Swords, absolutely. This is someone else energy too. Should I contact them? I don't know. When options? Should I? Should I? A little hesitant, but they will, especially if you're dealing with someone in the past. Someone you may not have talked to in a while here with the Temperance card. Some of you guys have been waiting for something with finances and it's coming. It's been a while, but it's coming. I love it. It's answering all of your questions here. Finances and love. It's just going to be blessings just poured in your lap. Let's get this Three of Swords. I love it. Three of Swords. Yeah, Three of Swords. A lot of you guys have been, there's been things that interfered with your love life. Into things that have happened with your job. A lot of, you know, conflicts with people at your job, that type of thing. But when it came down to your love life, someone came in, someone came in and ruined it. That's how you feel. There was interference, a lot of conflict, a lot of fight when it came down to even with your person. Someone you guys were dealing with was very sneaky. Running away from the truth. Unwilling to compromise. And that's what hurt you. Let's get the Ace of Cups. Wow. Look at what came out. Wow. Release. Shed. The tower is a new beginning. A lot of change. Things that are you guys are not even expecting is going to happen here for you. I'm telling you, this is amazing. This is happiness. This is healing. This is new. This is everything. This is amazing. <laughs> this is the answer to your prayers. Absolutely, Capricorn. This is what you guys have been waiting for far too long. New love is in your reading. And it's what you guys are wanting. This is what you're wishing for. Let's get the Knight of Cups. Knight of Cups. Some of you guys are going to have more than one person. Really. And for some of you, this could be someone that you guys have dealt with in the past. Yes, that has caused a lot of confusion. Maybe they didn't know what they wanted to do for some. I see new all the way here, though. But, you know, all readings are past and new. But I do see for some of you, this is someone that you guys may have known. But some of you guys have more than one person, okay? Let's get the Two of Pentacles. Look at this. Giving it up, right? No more of that emotional roller coaster. New love is coming in here. I told you, new. This is amazing. These blessings are being poured on your head. <laughs> That's what's going to be heavy. No more of this anxiety. What's going to be heavy is going to be this new love. Absolutely. Reigniting for, for some, but man, how, I mean, what a happy feeling you guys are going to be feeling. Let's get the five of wands for Capricorn. Wow. Look at this. Some of you guys are fighting your way to this victory, this new, this newness that you guys have. It doesn't even matter. Does this pass? I'm not saying that the past don't matter or that what you're going through don't. But when I tell you, when this come in, what you guys are going to be feeling, this is going to be a distant memory, I promise you. The pain, we need to write that down. The pain is going to be a distant memory because this is going to be everything you've ever wanted. This is your calling. This is your answer here with the judgment card. Uh, call card. <laughs> Amazing. Reconciliation for us, uh, for some of you. And then new, new, new blessings for others. Queen of Pentacles. Your money is going to be amazing. Absolutely. Whatever burdens you've been carrying, that's going to get put down. 
because there's some new opportunities here with the full card. Balance your energy out. Be patient. It will come. Let's get the Eight of Pentacles. Eight of Pentacles. No more juggling. No more of that. Sorry. Yeah, whatever has been ruined is going to get built back up for some of you. That means including your emotions. Tons of opportunities here for you is what I'm saying. But remember, like I said, as far as your emotions, this is what I've been saying. It's been very unsteady, very uh, controlled. But when I tell you everything, you guys are going to stable out. You know, no more of this conflict that you guys are feeling. Someone knows that they sabotage their connection and they're going to be begging to come back in. Mm -hmm. But money is going to be amazing. But either way, we saw it in the Tarot. We're going to go ahead and get some financial cards here. Let's get it for Capricorn. Finances for Capricorn. Again, a lot of unexpected here. Good unexpected things. And for some of you guys, this does talk about unexpected expenses that you guys may have to pay for. And this could be like, you know, uh, you know, something you got to fix something in your garage or something like that. It's not always major. But I do see so much goodness here. I'm telling you, you're not even going to know that it's coming. It is very unexpected because we saw the tower came out before. But it was with amazing things, right? Here with Motivator. You guys need to get motivated. Hopefully, I'm doing that for you guys. Okay. You are going to feel that, though, with that Ace of Wands. It is coming in. Let's get the last one. There we go. Success will find you. Absolutely. This card, this reading was amazing. You couldn't tell me nothing. Some of you guys are very charitable, but make sure you give to yourself too. See where you can give more of yourself to helping others and make a difference. But not only that, it talks about um, doing this would attract abundance, but giving to yourself also. Man, what an amazing reading. I love it. Okay, I love it. Like I said, for those who do not know, I do have your three-month reading that's coming. At the, no, it's, I've already done it. It's going to be in the pinned in the comment section. That's your three-month reading. Your part, That's part one. Part two is going to either come tomorrow or Wednesday, okay? Um, so, yeah, I mean, amazing. Um, and also, if you guys are new, please like and subscribe. If you guys are interested in a personal reading, uh, that information is in the description box. Capricorn, I love you guys. I'll see you back here tomorrow. Bye, guys.